Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So back in early October last year, I let you know that Microsoft had confirmed that the edge settings are going to get faster with WebUR2, which basically boosts um, the page responsiveness and also introduces a series of minor visual and content upgrades that will improve the overall usability and utility of the browser. Now that video will be linked down below and in the end screen. And my reason for mentioning it is because currently in the stable version, if we head to the main menu, we can see that's opening quite quick. That's using WebUR2 and has got an acrylic effect. And an acrylic effect, in case you're unaware, basically creates a translucent texture. So you can see we've got this orange brown color and you can see that kind of pops through. So it's translucent and it's picking up and painting the same color in the menu as what is on the background. And if we head to our apps, we can see no web UR2 and no acrylic. That's just a solid gray. And if we head to history, that's got web UR2, but no acrylic. That's just almost a solid kind of dark gray black. And if we head to the extensions menu, we can see that's quite old school and quite legacy where it's just got the normal solid gray that has featured for quite a while in the Edge browser. Now, just to let you know that if we pop over to Canary, that the extensions menu now is finally using the acrylic effect. Um, and if we head to that, we can see unlike the stable, that translucent effect is painting the same, same kind of orangey, kind of dark orange background as the wallpaper behind the actual extensions hub and menu. And if I head to favorites, that's using WebUR2, but no acrylic. The same would apply for the browser essentials. Uh, still nothing sorry that's just edge canary with a bit of a bug it is quite unstable still nothing for the apps we can see still solid gray just like it is currently in the stable version yet the main menu has also got the acrylic web yard too where you can see that color popping through that menu so just a quick video maybe nothing really major to write home about and um, at one stage in edge canary all these other menus like favorites and history were all acrylic translucent but i see now that they've kind of become a solid color still using web ur2 but the extensions for some reason that menu and dialog is now exactly the same as the main menu a bit, bit translucent as you can see but if we head to stable we can see um that extensions menu is a solid a gray and this acrylic effect in the extensions dialog and menu has been floating around in the canary version of edge for a good couple of months and i only noticed it today in my region so it's very hard to say if this is actually something that's going to come to the browser and um, but just putting it out there in case you are using edge so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one